Hi everyone, I'm Thomas Kincaid. One of the most fascinating challenges I think any artist could have is attempting to envision paradise. Now, of course, we all have different ideas of what heaven may look like. This is an attempt as an artist to take us step by step along a pathway to paradise. Of course, the first painting in the series was The Stairway to Paradise. And if you remember that painting, it really had a lot of light just pouring out over the scene as the stairway ascends to an upper area where we see light pouring through in the distance and a lot of mystery. We don't know what's just beyond the scene. Well, the second painting in that series is, of course, Pathway to Paradise. Here we've come up this stairway and we are making our way along the path. As we travel down this path, we see light illuminating our way. It's as though droplets from heaven are bathing the path. The green verdant lawn is glowing with that golden color into the distance. The flowers are in every color. You see the pinks, the reds, pale aquas, orange, and salmon colors. What a spectacular symbol of God's love, all the colors that we see in nature. Light is central to this painting and to this series. I really enjoyed the effects of dappled light in the foreground. I used a lot of texture to create a radiant sense of light. In the prints themselves, especially on canvas, we will try to capture and replicate that texture. And of course, the light is just filtering through the stately tree that we see at the right of the composition. I love the effect of light as it penetrates the foliage and shines in shafts, almost like the glory of heaven as it penetrates the air. Of course, the star of the show is the classic Greek urn that we see there. The beautiful shape of that urn as it overflows with flowers, uh, very suggestive of timelessness. I wanted to capture the effect of a moment frozen in time as though this could be any time, any place because truly that is the definition of eternity. Now, of course, all my paintings feature light. Of course, I'm known as the painter of light. Well, in this painting in particular, I created an accentuation of the contrast between the light and dark areas. And if you look carefully along the lit areas, you will see warm colors that make the transition from light to shadow. Now, as we dim the light on the painting, Look at how the lights of the foreground dappled sunshine and the light radiating on the urn and the light pouring through the trees begins to really stand out. We've changed the time of day now. It is dusk. Then as we bring the color up and the light up, you'll see a new glow begin to envelop the painting as though daylight is shining through. The sun is coming. It's morning once again. This is important to me as an artist because I believe a painting should be a living part of your life. It comes into your home and brings its message day in and day out. And I am often told by collectors, every time I see that painting, I see something new. And I've heard that so many times, and I think it's partly to do with the light. This painting at different lighting levels will appear different. So those of you who would bring this painting into your home, Attempt to light it in different ways, especially at different times of the day, and you'll see a whole new painting each time. Of course, in this collection of paradise images, I am really attempting to lead us on a journey. Now, starting with the stairway, we have now come to the pathway, and we are next going to be traveling down this pathway, and we'll be venturing into a whole new vista that I'll be sharing with you at a future time. Each painting I create is a messenger in the home. It's a silent messenger. It doesn't move, it doesn't make any noise, but it hangs as a backdrop to your life, imprinting itself silently day in and day out. Families today, more than ever, need security. They need the sense that there is more to life than just the bad headlines we see in the news. There is hope and there is beauty in this world all around us. I call it light. God's light, and it does shine in this world if we just stop to look at it. God bless you, and thanks for sharing the light.